It's about 8 a.m. I'm up because I hear an alarm blaring. Let's see what that's about. Your phone and alarm are going off. And the day begins. Simba's getting his sips, so all's right in the world. All right, the plants are looking pretty done. No fruit, nothing to speak of on this one. No fruit, nothing to speak of on this one. Got a lot of tomatoes on both of them, but they're done. I don't know what to do with them now. I'll ask my dad tomorrow. This one still has little baby green little babies. So I think I'm going to give this one like a little more food. Let's get those tomatoes going, the ones that are left. I mean, the plant looks nice. See like six little green ones on here and I want to eat all six of them. So I really want to feel like making a video right now. I want to do react from a kick and geese channel, but I'm actually really hungry. And in fact, I'm so hungry that I don't even want to make what I want to make. Cause there's a gravy I want to make and I'll show you that, but <laughs> I'm too hungry. I have to eat before I'm ready to make food. So I'm going to have some cereal. All right, 12.51. Just having a little um, engine two moment to start with. All right, I haven't eaten anything else, but I am about to go live on Cake and Geese. So I'm really excited about that. I love doing that. Then afterward, I think I'm going to make the McDougal golden gravy I keep hearing about. I have the recipe. I have the things. That's the plan for today. All right, this is Amy's no chicken noodle soup. It's really good. And just some leftover rice and vegetables. Some salt, pepper, some parsley on there. Delicious. All right, I got a peach. It is 5.54 and that's it for now. I was thinking today and the thing is, it's really hot in here. Like, I don't know what it's, over 80 degrees inside the house, air conditioning, full blast. And I can imagine that might be problematic for my appetite. I am sweat, like there's beads of sweat on my face. Can you even see it? It's horrible. Over it. <laughs> Look, Mert's getting air. <laughs> Why is that so funny to me? See that? There she is, right there. <laughs> All right, Mert just got some air. How is that? Annoying as f Oh. I know, I'm, not, I'm, I'm like awful and I was cackling at her. You are awful. <laughs> Yay, we're going to the dispensary. It's not that special. We've done this a bunch of times now. Bobby, what is that building? That's so mysterious. What is that? See that? What is this building? We, we've literally never... No! 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 Is what it turned into. Are you gonna show everybody what you got? I don't know if I can. Do you think I can? It's a it's, prescription. It is a prescription. All right, you uh, guys. Yeah, maybe. Not. I don't know. Well, it's a YouTube. You don't. Well, know it's not like your videos are monetized anyway. Nope, they're sure not. All right, you guys want to see what I bought? Now, what type of effect does the sour diesel give you, as opposed to something else? I just love it. I love it. It's by far my favorite. It's always been my favorite strain. I've, I've, I've always sought out sour diesel. I just, I love it. Mm. Um, what, what kind of effects? Um, like, are you more relaxed? Is it a sestiva? Well, I'm more relaxed, but I'm also creative. Mm. Meaning I'm relaxed, but I also don't feel, 
you see me, I do things. You like, do do things. I, I bop, you know, I do things. Like, it doesn't put me on the couch. That's what I love about it, but I'm relaxed. And I'm also hungry, which is a bonus because I've been having a bit of an appetite thing lately. Okay, so why don't you talk about the effects that it has for your MS? Well, I'm walking a million times better. I think so. What do you think? Oh, I definitely think that you're walking a lot better than what you were. Right? Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, there was a point where you couldn't get around the house without, without a cane. the aid of your cane. And yeah. that's, you know, we don't live in a huge house, so... You yeah, know, that goes to show how the unnerving sad it was. sound of tink, tink. It's like an old grandmother that like you're about to get in trouble. I, know. I had to use. This wasn't that long she used ago, to guys. Open doors with the cane, like so extra about it. This wasn't that. Let's explain. This wasn't that long ago, right? No, no. When was your last uh, exacerbation? It's the end of March. It was the end of March. Yeah. And then I had a real, and then I got better, but then I got kind of worse. Yeah. I think because it was hot out and it was Oh, summer. that's right. So then I started using this and now I walk, not amazingly, but I don't need the cane around the house anymore. No, right? you don't. No. Not around the house. Mm -mm. I mean, I still use it when we go like to the just, store. Or... Right. Like I used it in the dispensary just now. But what's weird about it is that a lot of times I don't need it, like in the moment that I'm using it. And I, I feel, <laughs> I feel kind of like, I don't know. Cheating. Yeah, like like I'll be using the cane, and then all of a sudden I open a door or something, and I'm using the, walking fine without a cane, and I feel like. No, no I don't think anybody understands what I'm trying to say. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? Oh, hundred percent. Yeah, like I feel like I'm lying. You know, yeah, it's but you're great. Not. You're not I, lying. I'm fully not lying. I I really suck at walking, but it's been a lot better. Yeah. And I'm, so happy. Oh, wait. All right, you're blocking my side room mirror. Fun I would say that I'm starving. You are starving. I've, I've hit she, starvation. She, well, she's been working. Since what time? A million... Uh, you've been working like a million hours. Yeah. And now it's 7.19. I mean, it's it was a long day. You know, she's hungry. All right, Mert, Mert was just talking about how she wants to get pulled I do, over. And it's a weird thing. <laughs> she, because it's like... I. I yeah, it's like I want to get pulled over because I want them to be like, oh, is there anything you shouldn't have in the car? And then be like, well, there is marijuana in the car. A lot. Yeah, a lot of marijuana. <laughs> and I want Justine to use her medical marijuana card and, you know, like, like just like pulled over for something stupid. Like, oh, you didn't blinker. Like, you know what I mean? Not like a big pullover, a little one. You know what I'm saying? Erica's got fresh car insurance too, so she's I do. like, pull me the like F a, over. Right, it's like I have a fresh <laughs> policy, you know, but like I don't want to be pulled over for anything like really bad. Because like I try to be as good of a driver as I possibly can be. Um, so And she and, is. And I am. But like I just, just a little bit pulled over, just a smidge. Ah. You know, like, ugh. <laughs> that, that you would were be doing great. 60. Coming off the ramp, the speed limit's 50. What? You know, like a little bit. It smells like marijuana in here. Right, <laughs> right. That's what we want. I would love that too. It's like, well, officer, I got my card here. Right. I got my receipt. This is from the dispensary. Right. <laughs> oh my God, we're at the diner. I'm hanging up. Yes. All right, I got a big pile of hash browns here. And I got an English muffin too. What'd you get, Mark? Well, that doesn't look very starchy or friendly. Or vegan. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, well, I, I forgot to vlog anymore. It was amazing. It was like an impromptu decision to go there. But that was a giant pile of potatoes, so I, I ate like half of it. What I really wanted today was potatoes with that golden gravy. But I don't have the tahini. I, I forgot to buy it, so I can't make it. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow.